wisdom and technical innovation from earlier eras bring humankind new knowledge, and we immediately use it to find new ways to kill each other off. Greater empires build more powerful armies, but brute strength may be defeated by superior innovations. It is brains versus brawn, with ever richer cities as tempting spoils for the victor. Whatever you think of the agrarian English, don't complain about their cooking. They'll come after you with their longbowmen. Oh, look at our little medieval villages now. Medieval buildings. Lovely. Masonry researched as well. Good. Right. So, we've made it to the medieval era. It is now 695 BCE. Lovely. Um, we're still going through organized warfare because we're playing catch up on some stuff. But, now that we're through here, Imperial Power, where is the... Oh, we get, we get peasants. Which means I'm assuming... Oh, plus one food on f tile producing food. That's good. Crop rotation. Okay. War summons. That's what we need. 32 turns. Gets us pikes and longbow. I mean, I feel like in a way we should go straight for that almost. But let's finish off organized warfare because that gets us the battering ram. Oh, hang on. We've, we've queued things up. Hang on. Hang on. Let's... Not sailing. Organized warfare... And then on to war summons. Oh, great swordsman. Hello. Lovely. BC World Con Conquest went. <laughs> I should get sailing as well. Um, fishmongers and... Yeah, what will that go on to do? Trade expeditions, won't it? Should I get that now? Bef after war organized warfare and before longbows? Industry's always, yeah, in these types of games, always good because you, well, always good one to focus on because you need that extra production, don't you? Um, right, let's continue our war as well. Need sailing for embarking. It's true. Right now, though, we're not looking to do a huge amount of that, so I'm not too worried. Let's open up the battle. Um,. move here and then we can shoot these guys no, no. I get the feet oh no we might we might just do it you know we're doing huge damage to the Korean guard here oh no I should wipe them out come on finish him finish him finish him oh it didn't quite finish him oh no it did it's just taking its time oh no we lost that unit though oh unlucky Oh, that sucks. Um, we could go in against this. They've got... Oh, they've got another horde behind us. Oh, because they're coming in to attack us. Evenly matched. We're... I'm going to retreat because, yeah, we're struggling. Pull back here because we've got another army fresh, recovering, looking to repair. Fortify. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oi, yoi, yoi. Um, yeah, let's take a look at food now. 48. So we went from 29 to 48. Oh, what's the, oh yeah, agrarian. What's this do? Um, agrarian empires receive more fame when earning agrarian era stars. Uh, greener pastures attract one pop uh, from each adjacent territory's city or outpost. Uh, it will create a grievance against you for each impacted empire. Um, gains five stability when gaining population. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's upset some people. Did I just pull them from my own cities? Yes. Whoops. I think I did, didn't I? I just pulled them all from these. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. The capital having more pops in is is okay. I should I should have clicked on this one and then done it. I think. Ten turns. That's cool. Oh yeah. So yeah, you gain them from other ones. Yes, yeah, so I should have clicked up here. That's okay. 
Not hard using proper roaming tactics, rotating the front line use out for recovery. Exactly. Um, that that's that's fine. Honestly, we could have we could have made that loads worse. Um, <laughs> quite a bit of money. That's okay. Industry. If we drop one back, we go to minus one, so we don't really want to do that. Research. We probably want to keep that where it is. Pop every six. Oh, we're only getting ten. We're already getting 10 food now because of all the extra pops we just brought in here. Right, yeah, that hit us heavily. Yep, 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 yep. Um... That's fine. But yeah, if we go back over here, food's going to be pretty big. Not over here, though. Um, okay. And turn. I would rather spit at your feet, but custom dictates I greet you. Hello. That's still in the classical. I'm already angry. Do not drive me to violence. And give them that. Plus two, I'd have to get 2,250. New. I really don't want to become a puppet state, so... Just going to have to keep fighting them. They're filled with hate. But it means it's quite annoying because it... What it means is that I should probably... I probably should forget about that one and try and push through here to hit their capital. That would inflict pretty substantial, um, hopefully a pretty substantial hit to them. Um, can't retreat from that one. Let's close this. Why can't I bring these guys in? Those are in battle, which is that one there. Why can't I choose these guys to then move them? They're locked. Oh, it's locked into a battle and cannot move. Before the oh, but they're not being called in to support me. Ah, that sucks. Do I? Oh, is reinforcements a research? Oh, God. Oh, use reinforcements is organized warfare. Son of a gun. There's no way I can instantly finish that research, is there? Dang it. Okay. All right, what have we got here first, anyway? Land and freedom. The Empire is a vast, glorious land of mountains and grasslands, stretching countless leagues and full of wonders and mysteries. Over many generations, your people have subdued many of its corners, but now you must ask the question, to whom do these lands truly belong? Land rights. Plus 10 food per number of attached territories on all cities. Um, or allows to claim, attach, and merge territories and merge territories with money instead of influence. Claim, attach. Uh, ooh, that's that's interesting. Um, we're currently at that one there. It would take us up to money on outpost. Probably go for this one because that food is great. Can't do it right now. Anyway, don't have enough influence. Cavalry can't attack fortification moves to win side. They're missile cavalry, so they'll just shoot up and over the walls. Can't retreat from it, uh, so I'll have to fight it. My poor troops can't reinforce, though. Lyrip. Um, my flag's over there. Pop 
them on that one. In deployment. Yeah, it's going to be on. I think they're, they're going to break me. Just. Because they're just their numbers. Oh my god, if they'd had a chance to heal. I can spend gold to heal them, actually. I might do that after this, if we somehow survive. Ay, ay, ay. I'm really enjoying it, Storm Caesar. How are you finding it? Put my archers out there in front, specifically so that they uh, would focus on them. I don't have enough troops to kill them all. That's the problem here. Rip my unit. First humankind sieve. I mean, right now, yeah, I feel like I prefer humankind to civilization. Just because this is newer and fresher and it does a lot of things very differently from Civ. So I like that. Um But um Yeah, we'll see we'll see how things go over time. But yeah, I, I do I do quite like this. It's quite a nice sort of fresh take on it. I reckon I can probably take out that unit of Honic Horde, but that's about it. So, death and glory. Might as well take one of them out before we die. Yeah, I can take out that horde. Make them lose at least one. Oh. I was about to say, oh, I clicked out. I was like, where did that battle end? I clicked out of it. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, guys. So I'll lose Rome, so I'll need to reclaim it with my other army. This could be where the Huns... Well... The, uh... What are they now? Are they Aztecs? Whoever they are now. Could get the upper hand on me. Well, we might just have to seed that one and hold here. I'd like to try and see if we could break them. It's the fact that they've managed to vassalize these guys is quite annoying, quite frustrating. Here's the Aztecs. Oh, wow, huge damage. Go for it. Drop on a hill, that's why. Nice, got the kill. I mean, we're making them pay for it. In blood. Just keep... They just keep bringing more and more of them in, though. got like an advantage from the high ground here so it makes sense to just keep attacking this one huge damage but now we have oh we have battle at rome oh sorry actually what am i right in thinking it wasn't for rome it was after outside actually yeah they didn't build any siege equipment we've lost all of our units they've lost two we lost the whole regiment we could go attack them now with these guys are they Spend some gold just to make fully heal them. Let's get our revenge. Fight, fight. 
Send in the second legion. Yeah, you cowards. Run. Let's move. And now they can get attacked by uh, multiple enemy armies now. Move. Yeah, whoops. Comeback starts here. Yeah. <laughs> Someone feels differently about us. Oh, yay. Where are you guys going to go? You're on your own. I'm, I'm going to try and find you to kill you. Um, we got up here. They've got loads of other forces. They're probably all going to bring back together. Um, it's probably smarter for us to hold up in Rome. Seems we pop walls there just for the moment. I do not live for revenge. I guess it depends. If their war support drops, then they'll be. If mine drops too low, then I'll be forced to make peace when I off surrender. Um, have we done with just current relationship? But if they lose enough, then they'll have to peace out when all the, the population will do it. But bonus from affinity because a militarist minus one from one city occupied by opponent, one ongoing. Right, yeah, Northern Rock. That's the unfortunate thing. Probably shouldn't have taken that. That, that, yeah, did not do me many favours. Just station there. You're getting another pop soon. I feel like we should probably work on this. I still don't know. No one's been able to tell me if this wonder, that, the effects from it, is that in every single one of my settlements or in the territory attached to a city, that's where it applies it. The plus 20 stability. Mm. You're working on the farmer's quarter to get your food back on up. We'll get reinforcements shortly. Fossil's Mount, you've got the harbour in two turns. And Rome is finishing off with the commons quarter shortly, which is going to go in there, isn't it? Which will get more stability for it. Organized warfare, lovely. So we now get use reinforcements. We can now get battering rams, and we can get barracks to reduce uh, ten percent on unit industry cost, which is nice. Twenty-seven turns till we can get longbows. Lovely. We can go jump on them quite nicely. Let's do that. Ah, your wusses. Thing is, we yeah, we're facing them, which is increasing our war effort against them. How how is their war effort actually? Plus two from war support below could have been uh, value during peace. Ah, that's why. Yeah, we're up. we're up on that all the time. Fine. Headset battery died. Swap one out. Swap one in. It's gonna be it's gonna be a long war. We're in this for the long haul. We might. <laughs> we might just get this done. This war, perhaps to a conclusion. Next Tuesday. <laughs> when we stream some more. Humankind. Right. They wussed out. Um Claim your territory. No. If only. We could go across and ransack it, but I'll just... I think I'll just stay here. Yeah, Rome, you just put that. So you've got stability increasing rather nicely. And we're getting some more influence as well. Uh, districts, we can get that stronghold, can't we? And it counts as a... Counts as a farming district, didn't it? Didn't it say? Council the farming quarter. Oh, so then adjacency bonuses for other farming quarters. That's pretty cool. Combat strength in combat for units or in adjacent uh, to the district. That's really quite nice. I'm um, thinking though, maybe just maybe we want to recruit another unit or two here. Well, it takes a lot longer to get them from here. 
if I went for an archer, could I? Oh, no, I can't. Sort of, oh, we need. What we need to do is another another maker's one, then, don't we? Actually, so yeah, scrap that. Go for another maker's course so we get another another one to build up. That's plus five, plus three, four. Probably plus five is going to be the best we can do. And that'll take the stability up to 20 because it gets a bonus from that. Um, Sinji's from adjacent ones, yeah. Let's just pop you in here. That makes the most sense. Buy out with population. Buy out this construction with the cost of a pop. So, so for six pops, you can have it done. Bloody heck, no thanks. Battle for the mine. The great city of Pride Rock is bursting at the seams. Countless souls pressed within the city's tight borders. In the dense, squalid quarters, cases of madness are on the rise. Religious leaders contend that demonic forces are behind the afflictions, while the philosophers argue for natural causes. Both are strong voices in the Empire without competing solutions. Uh, or oh, not without, sorry, with competing solutions. What is your response? We can study. Uh, learning on three cities plus 15 sites for 10 turns. Uh, fanatical. Plus 25% faith on three cities. For 10 turns, we don't need to pray. We've got plenty of that. Or we can judge. As soon as we get 100 gold. Um, seize our wealth. I'm going to go for study. Because, yeah, more science, please. You're that takes from 27 to 15 access. turns. Well, there's something to be said lovely. for unswerving dedication to a cause. Lovely, lovely, lovely. How are we doing on the old... Oh, wow, look at that. We managed to, yeah, get 100% pressure up there. That's good. Really need like <laughs> things we're in the wrong we're not far enough into the game for other the other factions to probably sail over here and harass these guys. I like playing on like continent maps, but also at the same time I probably would have preferred everyone just on the same one to duke it out rather than be caught in a corner. But anyway, we got the the harbour coming in there. Farmer's court is nearly done. We got minus one food right now. You get a new pop in here, didn't you? Minus one in two turns. Oh, minus one. Maybe you have six. Pop you up in science. Oh, no. So we actually, yeah, we lose it. We need to have you in there producing food. It'll be fine next turn. Yeah. Because we got that in there. Lovely. I am going to get some more warriors. Uh, we're recruiting up to there. That's fine. Let's get another army. Let's keep going with the Praetorians because they they get the job done. They are not messing about. Going to queue up a few. Uh, but I'd rather them not take that long. So I wonder if I can drop... Oh, no. We need to drop a few more. We can't do any more at maximum amount. Dang it. Damn, damn, damn. Go into tech then instead. So what we really need is another industry district or something that enhances industry. Something like that, probably. So in fact, let's pop that out in front. Get the forge in there. And then let's drop you in there. No, that's not making any difference, so leave you in there. Uh, in fact, let's just swap you up to do more research. 12 turns left. Fight for supremacy here, so I know what to do across the sea, yeah. Population gain. Move fast as mount. Lovely. Um, stability. Yeah, we need to sort that out. We can probably get a nice bit of stability by popping this somewhere. Where it's got lots of adjacency bonuses. Only plus. Plus 10 is our best. Yeah, but that's not bad. We lose one food there. Where else are we going to pop? Another district, though. Just think for the future. Yeah, probably one there. Pop you right in. You're getting one pop every three turns. Still one pop every three turns. 
One pop every four turns. That's now still taking seven turns. That's made zero difference. Okay, one. There we go. One every four. Is that still the case when I do that? One every five. Yeah, that's fine. Now 11 turns on the research left. One every eight. I am... Going to move up here. See if I can see any of the enemy units. I can't. So we'll head back to Rome. Well, there's an infrastructure I can build for uh, reducing their uh, recruitment. Yeah, what was that one? Oh, that one. Yeah, the barracks. Yeah, we'll throw that in as well. that in there that should help nicely city sleeping oh no army sleeping i might try and push across here see if we can go ransack that or just find some of their armies to go after we could try and attack nosos Three turns, that's a lot of gold gained. They feel differently about me. Yeah, I'm sure they bloody do. Yeah, what can I do? Uh, land rights, food, number of attached cities. Yeah, I'm going to go that one. Why should individual wealth and political connections determine the status of something as timeless as the land? It's that. Well, yeah, increase food quite nicely. And yet hit very nicely, getting a new pop every every two turns. Lovely. That'll help fill up all our slots, then we'll start producing some more units. I'm not gonna fill up all of them, but you know. Food there's just got things going. Do, 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 do. Keep ransacking, still another pop, thanks. It should go to Rome. Nine currently, so we'll see if that goes up to ten. Turn pending. Someone's having a big old think somewhere. Yep, room got it. And we've also finished that. Cue there. Uh, we're yeah out of food. If I no. So we need to either recruit a unit or. Get another farming district. Or pop that somewhere. Ooh, that's quite nice. Ooh, plus eight. That's not be beneficial for when we get attacked, though. That's that's probably the most effective one. when we get attacked at the front. Um, or we can enact something like that. Animal barns. Do, 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 do. I feel like... Uh, can we do a unit quickly? Yeah, an archer. Let's do an archer because that will solve the food nice and easily. Let's hit Nosos. They're bringing an army up. The side is evenly matched. Um, we'll get a ram in a turn. I'm going to press the attack.
Yep, they've got one up on the cliffs. Citizens. You're holding pretty well. Fortification, guardian, friendly. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, these guys don't do so well. Let's slaughter them. I'm just going to tell it to defend, actually. Let's see what they do next. They bring these guys in that were their reinforcements. Or well, they just have a couple of them anyway. Oh, they're behind us. Hello. Cheeky. Move down here and hit them. behind. Wipe them out. But if we did before. They're gone. Good old Praetorians. How come I got another? Do they not choose to attack at all then? Damn. Oh, nice. We got a wipe. That's quite a big hit. Go in. the attack at all. They're coming down from there. Okay. So I can get down from there? Interesting. My turn's over. Okay. Let's finish that off next time. Yeah, I think we've got to push through here and try and hit some of the Aztec territories to make them want to give up the wall. And we'll leave their capital up here for now. I prefer them to move down into it. Let's just take these guys out. They're going to move in. That's fine. Oh, that's huge damage. Yeah. That high ground attack. Brutal. Absolutely brutal. Yeah. Oh, no, no, that. Bringing you guys in, you weirdly go all the way around that way rather than just down here. What stops you attacking from there? Nothing. Finish him. Victory! They lost six units. Eris are unlocked, yeah, because we'll just be slaughtering our way through right now. That's all good. Yeah, what deeds can we do? Nice, nice, nice. Oh wait, have we got have we got new wonders to do? Um, 
Okay, we're behind those in third. We're catching up though. Where do I check wonders? I always forget where they're from. Oh, it's, no, wait, I can't. It's every time you build one, right? Oh, Sean claimed one. That's where it was. Yeah, they've all been claimed. When do new ones appear? Or oh, you forget. Is it after I've built my other one? Maybe. Or every few. Is it not tech, is it? It's every few ages, right? Uh, I if I don't if I don't spend gold to heal them, I'm gonna get jumped on by these guys. So I'm gonna have to spend my gold now. I reckon. Or I'm gonna lose that second legion. Some troops there. Yeah, we're gonna stay put. Um, if anything, I'm gonna keep recruiting units here. I think. Um, my chariots any good against these guys? What was it that, that nerfed my chariots? Loving this music as well, by the way. It's great. Very chorusy. as to whether I should do a bit more industry first. Music is per culture. That's cool. Forge would get us a fair bit. I'm going to chuck that in, I think. Much pop, such wow. Yeah, once that barracks is done, things are going to be nice and cheap. Yeah, so these are now taking a single turn. Or at least that one's taking a single turn because it was... There was industry left over. Um, so that's one every three. What if I do that? Still one every three. Uh, okay, so we, we need a little bit more to get them popping out every single turn still. Just a smidge more. this. All civic backlash must be handled first. Oh, um, refuse, minus 50, or replace. Revoke codified laws and enact customary laws for legitimacy. You will not then influence any ideology proximity with the Mycenaeans will increase. Is that, that's their own ones that they've got to defy this foreign interference stability cost. Uh, we've also got a battle, haven't we? Because we're getting attacked. But, um, if one of your cities has one or more territories under the influence of another empire, you may force to change civics. It's possible to refuse it, but drastically, yeah, I'm going to have to accept it, I think. Replace. You have reached the end of an ideology axis. Force civic. Of all the epithets other empires may use for you, wishy-washy won't be one of them. Well, that comes up a lot of times. Oh, they're, they're about to be overthrown there anyway. Um, so I've, I've got to get more of my culture going over there, haven't we? Convert to English in do. We are strained. That's converting to English in do. Oh, 
Ah, because you've got that one there. If I detach this, can I attach it to one of my own territories and kind of grab that permanently, even though the war's still going on, do you reckon? No, can't be done while the city's occupied. Rats! The game thought of it. Clever. Right, we've got a battle. They are up against single... Why are they fighting this? Surely they're going to retreat. No? Burn it down. Burn what down? The city. That's going to be huge. Slaughter that horseman unit. Hit that one. Yeah, you go kill that. Oh, that one wipes. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Burn down the outpost before you take the city. Uh, okay. That's helped our war support against the Aztecs a little bit. Theirs is starting to go down because of recent losses. Grievances triggered, though. Plus eight. Victory in battle. Pressing, oh, we're pressing the faithful again. Ruddy egg. The total score is starting to go down there. It was 240 before. It's now 222. Two, two, two. So let's it just try and put them under pressure, fought. I think. Um, so nice when things are good for me and bad for you. Whoa, where does it tell you about their strength compared to yours? Strength overwhelming. We are much less powerful. Oh, there we go. Okay. If all their other armies are wandering all over the other kingdoms, see if we can go strike their capital. Because that, I would have thought, would really, really upset them. Unfortunately, we can't do anything here, so I don't know if it's going to rebel straight away or what. Yes, sir. Nah, adding my unit in there, stability increases. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Wait there for a bit. They've got an army here. I just need to keep on looking to produce units over time. With Fuster's Mount, you just got the Commons Quarter, so your stability should be on the rise. How long does it take you to recruit units? Not long. Not long. How far off are you? Okay, you're a bit off. Think, is there any more industry I can put in to have things? Uh, the forge, probably. Yeah, let's do the forge. And then I'll try and pump units out from there as well. See how their war support changes to percent. Looks like you're losing less than them right now, so I could wait them out and win once. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping we can push them. Uh, raiders of the Far Seas. According to hearsay, every springtime, longboat raiders have pillaged and looted lands close to your borders. Sailors hailing from the harbour in Pride Rocks, where they have seen such slender vessels on the horizon, even hearing the low, eerie sound of their rowing chants. Some say they even row upriver to strike into the heart of the continent. With your naval force weak, people near the border are frightened they will be next. They are threatening to flee. What will you do? Ashore. Lockdown on Pride Rock for 10 turns. Plus 10 stability, minus 10 industry. Not ideal. Ignore. We must. Uh, we have great concerns. The people must fend for themselves or hire a uh, new army raider fleet. 250. We don't have enough gold to do that. Otherwise, I'd quite like to do that one. What's that do? Minimize your choice before turn ends. Um, our stability is okay. Don't really want to hit that industry when I'm trying to pump out units. A raider fleet would be kind of cool though. I just I won't have the gold. 
I go for that, what's the, what, what happens if I'm negative gold? Like, how bad does things get? Does anyone know in this game? How bad is it to go negative? <laughs> Nothing bad. Oh, here you go. If you have a deficit, you will start losing stability. I'm going to risk it higher. Oh, that new army costs a fair bit. Oh, ouch. Yeah, I didn't think of it like that, did I? <laughs> we can go ransack, though. I'm just thinking we use this to go over here and harass these guys a bit. It's going to take quite a while, but why the heck not? Sarge. But we will need to shuffle some things around here a little bit for a bit more gold. Oh, we've got four turns to war summons. Bloody heck. One every 15. still recruit that in a single turn so that's fine minus two let's has no money that also has like no money uh, let's go here and no if we come off science it's not enough Still one in three turns. That one gets us positive. Boom. Starting stability. Is that going to be stability faction wide? Oh, that could be grim. So we find our next turn. That starts doing stuff. Infamous English Corsairs. Yeah. But yeah, these are real expensive. But we'll see what the cogs can do. Ransacking, maybe? Could be fun. Wait, can they... Just thinking, can they put an outpost? Uh, no land units. If I put a land unit in there, though, go create a little place over here and harass them. Maybe. I don't know if I can claim that or not. Bankruptcy. Cities are losing stability. Osmosis events. Converting to English soon. Holding at 10. Just stay where we are. They're coming to attack. Lost at sea. Will be destroyed next turn if it stays in deep water. Okie dokie. Take 
students because you need a little bit more industry. No, it won't make a difference. So back there you go. And you'll be popping up troops over here, which we will send. Uh, I'd like to go that way, but I'll probably get intercepted by a load of their troops. So I should probably send them around here. I'm assuming Arch is upgrading to Longbowmen. Like worth removing one boat. Yeah, possibly. Uh, how's that hitting our stability as well? Oh, we're dropping by minus one. Yeah, we can we can take that for the moment. We can take that. Once we once we ransack somewhere, we should be okay. Oh, well, they want they want to replace plus five influence on territories if territories follow state religion. Refuse. Yeah, we can't afford that. So yeah, got to replace that. Oh, being besieged. Oh, because oh, they brought those guys in as well. Rodiek. Osmosis event. Ay, ay, ay. And they've got a reinforcement army. Push out, we'll get surrounded by them there. If we do nothing, our army dies. Fun. Shippies go. Long we leave it, the worst thing's gonna get. Oh. Thanks. All of my military units will be destroyed. Or sortie on out. Uh, I'm gonna sortie on out. They're gonna attack me from there, but try and kill some of them. <sighs> Evenly matched, apparently. That's their flag. units though. How long have I got to capture the flag for? Is it the full four turns, isn't it? Adjacency bonus. Attack! Let's go! Let's go! Yeah. 
These guys stuck. No. You guys defend, and you guys defend. Well, you guys stuck and won't actually attack. Confused. Those other, I think those other reinforcements are taking a turn to come on in. That's what it means. So we can try and break the other ones before this lot come in. Why is it not letting me push ahead with it? I don't know. Wealth of the Faithless. The Empire stands for tolerance and religious freedom. Faiths of many domini uh, domination, uh, dom uh, yeah. denominations rather are welcome here. However, now that your own religion is stronger than ever, uh, with two holy sites found across the land, you have the power to decide if minorities of other faiths should be subject to taxes for peaceful coexistence. Plus 10 money on territories if territories follow foreign religion. Plus 1 stability on territories if territories follow uh, foreign religion. I'm going to go for tax them. Uh, it does reduce stability across all of them, but we get plus 5% money on city or outpost, and right now we need money. I suppose that's one way of convincing them to change faiths. Pay Had to reload regards? the game because of battle freezes. Okay, let's... Um... Throw in a save, and then load that one straight back up. See if that fixes it. This one, now the English. I'll update the stream title, but we're only going for another 30 minutes, so... We did. We did attack them. They made their move now. Their side's weak because they're bringing in their reinforcements. Out. Yeah, Valley of Death here. Not so good. And we might lure them into positions where we can smash them, but I, I don't think we're going to get lucky enough. They can move so far. that they can move and then still attack. I'm assuming even if they've used all their movement points, it's still separate for them. Yeah, getting surrounded by Huns. Huns? Yeah, yeah, by the Hunnic Horde. Oof. Yeah, they've all come in. Ouchie. Unfortunately, I don't have any reinforcements then, so yeah. They get me at Nossos. I'm going to have to just build up loads of armies before I push out. I can't push out with just one. I've got to have two supporting each other. Yeah, the fact that the Aztecs were the Huns before is really... Uh, so they've actually re-secured that whole thing. Oh, balls. My poor Praetorians. At least that, that will free up... Um, some gold. So there's that. Where's the horse arch, isn't it? Now you know why I kill horses. Yeah, hate them. Kill them all.
Human kind have achievements. Uh, Steam achievements. Uh, yes, it does. Uh, 98 of them, in fact. Yeah, my army's about to be wrecked. Yeah, I'm just going to have to build up a much bigger force to go for it. Uh, that's all I can do, really. That's all I can do. But we'll be able to get longbows soon, so maybe they'll be able to rain down some proper death. Rippers. We tried. Going to Aztecs in 10 turns. Okay, so we're still, yeah. Been all right. Our gold will be much happier for that. Which is good. Mycenaeans have reached the medieval era with the Mongols. Oh, good God. That's like the worst possible combo. Because now they're going to get the Mongol horde. And I'm going to be hit on all sides. I am listening. Uh... We could act with more dignity. Wiser statecraft benefits us both. Despite your good intentions, to accept so little would tarnish my glorious name. Interesting. If I cannot teach you wisdom, I will teach you regret. Oh, I can actually nearly peace out with them. My war support is dropping as well, which is not good. Uh, if I select those two terms, I'd still have to pay 615 reparations. This total is 131. That I can't get rid of. That's something that's in there that they won't back down from. But giving them that, Northern Rock, gives quite a lot. It was but a trifle. Please carry on with your day. Thank you for admitting the reality of our relative positions. If I could break them a little bit more, that might work. Oh, hang on. Are they... Oh, they're not a vassal anymore. How did they manage that? Aztecs... Oh, Aztecs declared war on the Mongols. Change of reputation. A warrior, level one. The Mongols make the following demand. Okay. Give Nosos. Yep. Give that. When they tech up, do they? does it clear the previous diplomacy state? How did that? How did they manage to get freedom? Crisis defusal. The Mongols have refused it. Yeah. How did they manage to become independent? currently got peace. They're suspicious of us. I could renounce it. Or I could demand because I don't want to be at war with both. Although, I guess that's why they, they're the peace as much is because they don't have the support of their friend now. Oh, I'm a thief. Level one. Well, having Spanish empires ransacking earns more money. Whereas these guys have got warrior. Right. That's why they're more willing to, to, to settle right now. Because they've lost a, an ally. A vassal. Ah. Uh, I mean, I'm going to... Grants you 20 war support. I'm going to refuse them. Grants them 20 war support. I don't want to withdraw stuff because I don't want to give them more war support. 
but I'm going to renounce that as well. It would be best to let bygones be bygones. I can only assume in these circumstances that you're joking. Okay. Can I roam across their land? Do they care if I trespass through their lands? Treaties. Border policy. Cannot be done with your first result on going demands. Ah, so. But then I could just go and conquer their lands now, myself, and they won't be. As they're also they're also at war with it would actually make sense to go to war with them because they are also at war with the with the Aztecs. Or I could uh, you'd like to think that they'd be on my side. I could get these guys to help me out by going using them to go to war against them. Keep them strong. Although I wouldn't mind taking Nosos. Yeah, we're not currently at war with them. We probably need to take a few turns to build up my armies. See you, Liam Edward. I need to refuse their demands, but I don't know whether they would. Because now that's gone, so they're wanting loads of money. I could withdraw my demands. I can't afford all that. But they could go to war with me, but then they if they do, would they really? Because they're getting attacked by the others. I'm going to refuse demands. A good ruler knows when to withdraw their demands. Now is that time. Cool. You've made the right choice. Amazing. And I will withdraw mine. I was simply testing the waters, you understand. Open borders. Propose. This proposition should be in all our best interests. Uh, I need to accept. They'll accept if I give them 180 gold. Come now, do you think so little? So we could propose an alliance because I could use the Mongols now to help me against. The Aztecs. I don't know how long I have to sort that out. I need to get me some gold quick. Probably recruiting more units right now isn't the isn't the, the smartest move. Um much as I don't want to get rid of one of these, I'm gonna have to. Because that gives me a lot more gold each turn. Try and build up two. I'm gonna have to get as close as I can to that border. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna. Not sure that'll actually work now, so I won't be able to go up and around. I should have to go all the way around this way. But they could lose Nossos actually, so we'll see. We shall see what they lose. Will I accept this offer? I would love to. Oh, I've got to do it this turn. I'm I'm sorry, refuse. But no deal is better than a bad deal. Rome's going to pop. Grievance available. The world is full of new opportunities, is it not? Hear my proposal. Fascinating and non aggression. Yet. Um, counter, yeah, for 120. I can go, got for refused. That. If you might be a little more considerate, no, I cannot agree to this anemic proposal. A mere I'll get rid of that one, mainly because I want to. Is this supposed to interest me? It doesn't to go for that. Can't go for that just yet, though. Okay, fine. Don't think 
that it's possible. Be good go. Rune's about to finish off the forge. That's good. Pride Rock, you've just finished constructing that. Pops every few turns. Industry. Let's get. How's our stability? Stability's okay. Alisades probably wouldn't be a terrible idea back at home, but we're not going to get threatened here. I wouldn't have thought just yet. Um, I think probably get that mausoleum going. We've already got Stonehenge over here. It's a thing. Shared pro. I'm assuming that's plus 20 stability everywhere then. Does it say here though? No, it doesn't say from Wonders, whereas this Pride Rock does, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, from Stonehenge, so it does matter where you put it. Science per district, one city, so it would probably make sense to put that up somewhere else. I'll pick that up in that up on the hilltop. Be quite nice. Right now, more production, though, wouldn't be awful. Go for that plus nine there, I think. It's all good. We've got the gold coming in. We're getting another one in four. Let's pop you up there. This will take seven turns, actually. Might as well leave you doing that. Unless... Two turns. Yeah, into the science. Here you go. You can go across the shallows here. That'll do it. Ufasa's Mount. You've just finished getting your forge as well. Got a good pop of 15. Nice, 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 nice. Start getting me units if you want. Not quite enough industry for that though. Hello, 14. How is our stability? Not amazing. Got a commons quarter there already. We can easily fix it when it drops. Uh, we can also go for... Oh no, I've got it already. Get that up there. We'll fix it soon after with something else. It's falling. We'll be all good. Um, we won't be losing stability from being bankrupt either. You bring your stink here. Open the windows. Open the windows. Not my stink. Because that's yeah. I've got to pay them. Is that rep that reparation isn't indicative of that, is it? Cannot be done as all of the winning side's original demands. That one can't be done. Okay, so that can't be... Okay, that's good. So I don't owe them... No, one selected... Ter it's in there. I can't... I unclick that. It's because all of their... It was merely a passing thought. 
pay it no heed. Why are you so unhappy accepting the quite get that one. I can't do anything with that, but that will be gone. Will expire in six turns. Will that not? No, the demand never expires, does it? So they pushed it forward. So I'll have to pay 600 plus 585. So I can keep pushing at them. Keep harassing them. Because they demand it what auto locks, yeah. But I'm assuming it's included, right? A watery grey. The great coastal city of Pride Rock sends fishing crews far up and down the surrounding coastline. Now one of the new crews has made a startling discovery wreckage of an ancient galley lying well preserved in shallow waters after brief scouting. Uh, uh, an experienced diver offers to explore with their gang and promises a fixed payoff for the Empire. They warn that the expedition isn't uh, for the inexperienced. What is your choice? So we can mobilize. Our military can explore the wreckage alone. The rewards are worth the risk. Chance of unexpected consequences. We can contract them though and get 150 or we can get fanatical. We can protect it. I'm going to try mobilizing rather than doing the contract. See if I can get all the money for myself. So there is another city somewhere. Oh, it's up here. It's up here with the ebony. I go that way. Me cogs, me raider fleet. Rome is done with the forging. Your food, your food below. Uh, food on the river, food. Yeah, get. Yeah. Animal barns in there will do you right. Right, solid. I'll sort the out. Uh, that army is nearly good to start going. I don't know how their war with them is doing. I'd love to know. They've grabbed all of that there. Um, we can do skirmishes, but we don't really want to do that. We want to get military access to move through their land to go after these guys. So for the moment we'll just leave them garrison there because that adds stability if I'm not mistaken. Stability from units. Yep, plus 20. We have war summons. We can get longbowmen. Nice. And pikes. God, they cost a lot. We need to start investing in our gold a smidge. Oh, hello. We can go after them. We can go after them. Uh, I will be trespassing, though. Oh, no. Right, tech, what do we want to do? Heavy infantry, what's that do? One plus one unit slot for each available army. Nice. Rotation for an outpost, city cap, uh, and it interpreters. Minus 10% on all resources, money cost when buying resources through trade. A quadrium and provincial administrator. City cap. <laughs> Furnace steel. Trebuchet. Superior siege weapons. And get chivalry, which gives us tournament fields. And knights. Uh, mounted Warfare, Ransack, Parade, and Horsemen. Not too bothered by that. Fortification, Stone Walls. I feel like we're going to have to go back and grab some of this stuff now, aren't we? Money on Plaza, Trade Expeditions, Hydrology. Ooh, Stability and Aqueduct. Uh, yeah, I want that. And then let me grab Sailing while we're at it. Keep wandering, just keep wandering. Wandering, wandering. Um I'm assuming you, yeah, it can be upgraded with a lot of gold to a longbow unit. 
Not right now. Can we attack them? I can't because I don't have enough war support. Oh no. Oh, hang on. We're not at war with them anymore. What? You. What is it? Don't get. Oh, uh, but going. I need declaration of war right after at war with the Mongols, which I don't want to be. Proposition. You can make proposition 18 or wait, another two. I'm going to have to wait until I've got enough gold, though, to cover it because that's probably what they want. How are we doing on this as well? Fourth. Oh, yeah, they're nearly through to the next era already. Bloody yak. Population loss. Oh, yeah, due to fallen growth. But no, that's, that's actually helped us out quite substantially. That's quite nice. That's done that. Ooh, they're besieging. Dun, dun, dun. I mean, if they do, I'll be... Ooh, they're besieging them there. Bloody heck. Okay, right. Well, we <laughs> get ready to go, basically. Get ready to go. And... Uh, Oh, damn, it's not all off. Let's get through that. You have to stay there. Yeah, get ready to perhaps uh, see these guys fall, and then we can just push against them. Population gain. Rome's gained population, which now makes them unhappy again, but they'll be happy again shortly. Yeah, I can't go into this because I need war, and if we go out here, we'll take attrition, I think. Oh, I can probably just about make it, though. We won't be supplied anymore. Oh, there we go. There we go. It takes a turn. You get a turn before they run out. Struggling. What concerns you today? Frozen Alliance. This proposition should be in all our best interests. They just straight up refused it. Your proposal is too much of a ball and chain on my ambitions. Duly noted. Fine, I'll renounce it for now. I can see the bigger picture. Let us no longer speak of this. You'd think they'd be kind of desperate to, considering they... Uh... You know, I'm already are under siege. Do not drive me to violence. We gotta finally start ransacking them with my cogs. Okay, so we've got that food in there. Nice. We can recruit some longbowmen, but that's 15 upkeep. That'd be very, very nice, though. Uh, we probably need to think about some money, though. Anywhere real good for more money generation. Not here, really. We just don't have the stuff for it. Um... What happened to Rome's walls as well? We had palisades, didn't we? Oh, it is there? It's just it's just a lot smaller because the I think the settlement's gotten yeah it's gone wider, so it's not right around here anymore. Right. Food on the river. We do have a fair bit of that. That's our stability. Stability's okay. That's quite nice. It's just not going to be that beneficial for its extra defense. That's why I didn't build it before, isn't it? Yeah. Not sure I didn't build it before.
Let's go for that because we do have quite a bit of food on the river. With five maker's quarters, an empire could build all sorts of interesting and troublesome things. Things change. Even leaders and You empires. want non-aggression. I have a proposal for you. This um, I'm going to count you still. <sighs> I refuse. You should give me some gold, this mate. feels wrong. Demonstrate genuine fit. Can't go with that one yet. That's fine. It gives me more time to build up a bit of gold. influence isn't much for use. I mean, you need gold to be able to get, build up your armies. So that's like quite an important one for that. I haven't done much trading yet, to be fair. That's true. Um, I can get more pops, pull them in. That will probably upset people though, won't it? Um, yeah, it's not worth doing that. It's not out in the middle of enemy territory right now. Who fast as about? You've just finished that one, so you're good on industry. Can you produce units in a single turn yet? You can get more Praetorian Guard, which is nice. Getting one pop. Uh, every one of those. Oh, yep. You probably... More units would actually equal more growth. I am going to recruit you guys a longbow unit. Over there. Oh, you're so close actually being able to... I wonder if I do... Oh, not in a single turn though. That's unfortunate. Yeah, the Praetorian Guard though. Yeah, we still do a Praetorian Guard for now. Hydrology researched. Yeah, the aqueduct's going to be great. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, they're coming to attack us there. End of foreign war. War between the Mongols and the Aztecs has ended because they've been once again. <laughs> Great. Uh, son of a gun. Am I at war with them again? Yes, we're at war with the Mongols now. Tell me what you wish to discuss. How did, I, I still don't understand how they managed to kick them off in the first place. What is it? Don't get comfortable. I'm going to try and break their armies a little bit. Unfortunately, they've got more troops over here. I can try and retreat. Let's do that and get away. Try and save the unit. There was a time to ever upgrade a longbowman. Now is the time. See him in battle. Now nah, they're gonna run. Cowards. Keep together. Move down to try and stop that army over there. Okay, Pride Rock. We're going to need some troops again from you. Get me some Praetorians, please. Then longbows. Give me some longbowmen. Ooh, we're going... Stability's going low. that aqueduct yeah that's gonna have to go on um i'm gonna 
risk it for the moment. Going for the archer first. the wall lasted um what is it tell You'll us how long it's been going on for many many turns many many turns it's getting uh it's getting lower and lower we give them northern rock but we've still got to pay them like so much gold i won't be able to do it we probably will peace out with them but i've got to find a way to get a load of gold first I don't know if these guys can ransack from the sea, can they? No, there's no harbors or anything. Really hoping they'd have a harbor that I could assault, because otherwise I should get rid of these guys and save myself some gold. We'll do. Ah, oh, that's annoying. With you, aren't I? Or the Mongols? Have you come to shame yourself once more? I'm very confused. Why is that telling me I can't declare war on them? rock um we are going to want to sort out of stability still okay though give me a long boat sailing research ah. all those extra troops oh confrontation 202 this is 130 Ah, because these guys are all reinforced. Oh, because they're they're close. Oh, that's good. Oh, God, yeah, reinforced. I definitely should have got that way sooner. Would have helped me out a lot more. Stay together. hold. I want to see you in action before we end things today. Before you get smushed as well from all sides. Ow. long. Oh, still coming up. Survive. Survive. One dude left. Give me it.
You can fire from there. Fortunately, you can do. Uh, you can. You can do some huge damage. Fire at that one. Massive. Take that one out. Retake my flag. You have two rounds to reclaim it. Okay. Back when it's my turn anyway. these guys. Spawn presence is blocked by another unit. Uh, what, that. Oh, so we've got to reclaim that. Good eat. Oh, I can spawn it at my city. Right. charge on in there. Don't know if I get my flag back in time. Oh, no, they come off it. That's good. Then I can get a unit over there to reclaim it though. Try and wipe out all the units in a single go. Oh, you're kidding me. I've gone for that one. Oh, 100%. Nice. Still can't get out, though. Can I? anywhere if they don't then i'll have to disband these two next next turn because there's like zero point to having them next to harness the power of water itself 
in order to feed your people. That I do not, not live for revenge, but I could die for it. Good daft. Send you thing. It was but a Oppressing my people. Please carry on with your day. I can't do any more with that. For admitting the reality. Nope, nope, nope. Don't have enough war support to help me done as you have to declare war and you don't have enough war support. That makes no sense. I'm definitely at war with you guys. Why can't I go into their borders? Huh? Well, I mean, I might not be able to carry this one on if we can't go into their territory. Unless I have to peace out and then really clear war or something like that. No, but we'll be so massively in debt. That might be better than nothing. Yeah, I don't know why I can't... Why it's saying I don't have enough... Can't not be done. As you have to declare war and you don't have enough war support... I don't need to declare war. We're already at war. <sighs> Is that a war you don't end up with, with that, even though we are at war with them? And I can't declare war on them. So I probably have to peace out and then declare war. Ah, oh, that's going to be annoying. Well, we'll wrap things up here and see what happens next time. I think we're going to probably have to just take offer the surrender. See if they take it and then redeclare water. Um, unbug it basically. And uh, keep going from there. But yeah, watching this on YouTube until the next one. Ciao for now.